Hi everyone, it's Claire Rock from O'Brien Real Estate Clark alongside Mr. Daniel Sheehan, welcoming you to our first live open of 2024. 20, yes, I was yeah. going to say 23, <laughs> but it is 24, Claire. We are. 174 Albert Road. Yeah, Tell us about it. Just over a kilometre from town here, prime position. You've got buses down, up and down the street, so great easy access into town. And this is a classic 1970s renovated property, easy to move into or rent out. Okay, let's, let's have a look inside. A look. It's a good so, size block, you've got a good access down to the garage there. You do, absolutely. It's about 714 square metres in total. And the lovely cream brick veneer always makes a nice solid home. They certainly do. They were built to last these cream brickers. Got good hardwood frames. You can see as we come in the hallway there, you've got the hardwood flooring as well. So um, they've good, got good bones. Yes. So property has most recently been leased out. Tenants have just vacated um, over the New Year's break. So ready to move straight into or relet if you like, you're looking probably at about a rental return of around 460 per week. Now, yeah. also has a flexible floor plan because you can come in here to what could be a formal living space or a fourth bedroom. So gas ducted heating through the floor. Yes. You've got ceiling fans throughout, TV bracket up there. Yep. Um, and a couple of split systems as well for convenience, but Great. love the, um, the pattern cornices. Yeah. yeah, they're nice, aren't they? That's a freestanding road there, it's to be noted. Yes. And you've got this beautiful north facing aspect, so great natural light flowing through. Yeah, a few trees in the front yard there, a bit of privacy. We'll pop down to the bedroom wing first. So you can see up here, Daniel, first of two split systems. Yep. And I'll let you peek into another bedroom there. That's good size. Yeah, they're all good sizes. Now, like you say, ceiling fans in all rooms. No roads in this one, but it's plenty big enough if you wanted to add something on that back wall there. Absolutely. And you can see there you've got the privacy and the block out blinds. Yep. Yeah, good size room. Okay. Hopping around, another spacious one there. So another TV bracket on the wall there, ceiling fan, privacy blinds. So robes in this one, a little dresser there in the middle. And across the hall to bedroom three. Nice and sunlit there, it's a bit of afternoon sun. Again, ceiling fan. Another two door robe with some drawer space as well, and a mirror. And another TV bracket. You're, uh, brackets in all rooms. you're going to be well satisfied for televisions and ceiling fans. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of storage in here. Yep. And then I'll let you peek around to that updated bathroom. Oh yeah, so you've got new shower there. Single vanity, six drawers there, so plenty of storage in there. And separate two-way toilet. Yes, so the other door out there leads to the laundry, which we'll take a look at shortly. And another storage cupboard there. I think this was the real surprise package when I walked through this home for the first time. Just seeing this great expanse of living space and a lovely modern kitchen. So you've got a bit of a meals area there adjoining the kitchen. Another ceiling fan. Down lights there and yeah, it just pushes out the back nicely, nice open space, doesn't it? So. Mm, yeah, plenty of cabinetry, storage in the kitchen, good combination of doors and drawers and um, cupboards. Nice 900 mil stainless steel appliances, meal aid dishwasher, so really good quality as well. Mm -hmm. There's the second split system there, so yeah, pretty comfortable. Yes, you've got a little bit of a breakfast bar here for more casual living, but um, this nice elevation from this space to the backyard just gives you a really lovely outlook. Yeah, it does. Up here on Albert Road, you're uh, perched a bit high, so you can sort of see out over town. There's a bit of a glimpse through the trees there to the Streslecky Ranges, but a good sized backyard. Yes. We'll have a, have a wander out there. So you can see there another really big split system. And I'll let you pop through to that laundry. A 
you know, it looks like a bit of a drawing cabinet or cupboard there, the rail there. That's the two-way toilet we were just talking about. You've got your trough there, taps for your washing machine. Come here, room. And we'll pop out. Get you to just pay attention to that step when you pop down, Daniel. Beautiful big outdoor entertaining area. Yeah, amazing. So you'll get plenty of use out of this one. You can see you've got fly screens pull around. Oh, yeah, so the cafe blinds there that lock yeah. in. Yes. And shut that gate so you can fully enclose this just yeah. about. Yeah, absolutely. So if you've got young kids, you can keep them safe. They can only flow out to the, the backyard. But, yeah, really magnificent space to entertain and set up as a, a great year-round living space. Yeah. Yeah, good, uh, good play area for kids too. Yes. <clears throat> So who's coming out here, we're back on that driveway there, so access into the single car garage with the tilt door. Yeah, plenty so of space nice here. private backyard, you're not overlooked here at all either. Bit of uh, sundry shedding down the back, old garden sheds. Make of them what you will. But yeah, it's pretty private too, isn't it? It is, yeah. Nice established and a, a great tree. blank canvas, basically, to do with what you will. Yeah. Um, 714 square metres, obviously available to inspect now. Great position close to town. So if you're looking for a great investment opportunity or somewhere to live in, uh, this is a really good one to come and have a look at. We Thanks invite for you watching. to get in touch. We'll talk to you soon.